you're playing a software, you can't invite anybody while you're running a software uh, if you're playing a game at the same time. Which is really dumb, because why the hell would I invite- why, why do people need to know I'm playing a software? It's just a piece of fucking software. You need to put yeah, it in like, your Why status. do people know I'm futzing around in RPG Maker on something that will never see the light of day? It's just- I can't code for shit. It's just annoying, because uh, if you run a game while you're running a game, or well, if you're on one stream game and then you run another stream game, it'll tell you, oh, you have to turn off this other game, which is fine, but it doesn't do that for software, so obviously it can tell the difference. I don't know, I feel like this is just a problem unique to me because I use stream avatars. Anyway, you have been invited, so it's time for us to enter the mission selection. Yeah. We have three more uh, missions left Paris, Northern. Th uh, Cyprus and Roll Mountains. So for those now, who... Are we sure those are separate missions and not just like branching path? So I cheated and I looked up something. Um, the game can end with Paris, it will not end for us with Paris. Okay. So basically we've tracked down Grishin, um, uh, the leader and former CIA leader of uh, uh, whatever the group is called, Adrastea, and former CIA agent, and we have him cornered in Par Paris. So now we're up there, going out there to screw him over and capture him. I'm hiding. Oh no. Oh, with low profile. My silence pistol. So, let's see. Can't see me. So I can carry with uh, with me depleted uranium bullets. Um, oh right, I forgot about the war crimes. Uh, I would rather avoid war crimes, so instead we're just gonna have uh, regular ammo and two um, clips or our magazines of knockout ammo. Gonna get pager. I guess a remote modem. Special poison gas grenade developed for Spetsnaz hostage rescue operations. Very rarely lethal. Rarely enough to count on anyway. Oh, okay. Nerve gas. Okay, listen. These things are strictly illegal according to several international conventions going back to World War I. They're also goddamn horrifying. That being said, if you need a way to kill a bunch of people silently and gruesomely, these will do the trick. Um. So I'm not gonna bring that with me. I think we're fine with like two pagers and a modem. That's been helping us so far. Yeah, why is this like check man that lives in the basement so obsessed with making us do war crimes? I have no clue. US Navy SEAL. Almost certainly former CIA, based on the authorization codes as Navy records were buried under. Completely off the grid for the past 20 years. Christopher, the guy who helped us in Warsaw? That's him. He was right under our nose. We could have grabbed him at the party. Yes, if we had known then what we know now. I forgot how terrible Katya's accent is. He was working with Baxter. Why would he help Katya corner him? You said it yourself. You thought I was just some hustler. He knew Baxter was gay and you thought I was just a honeypot. Do we have his location? Yes. Grishin is an incredibly hard target. But we managed it. We've tracked him to a safe house in Paris. Grishin's hideout demonstrates a certain sense of the dramatic. He's using an old estate abandoned when its Jewish owners fled the Nazis. We've had eyes on it. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah, everybody. <laughs> Grishin has tickets to Paris this week. He'll be there. This is actionable intelligence. I'll grab him. No, I need you elsewhere. What could possibly be more important than Grishin? We can't bet it all on this lead. It's not a question of importance. Your skill set is more suited for another operation. Katia and Martin will handle Paris. Grishin sounds like he's a very dangerous person. Grishin has received the best training the U.S. government can provide, and he is highly experienced. Do not attempt to neutralize him yourself. Find him, identify him, and hold him there. And wow, that's, that, that, that was a good animation <laughs> loop there, Katia. <laughs> We've worked out a deal with a team of French contractors, former BFST. Can we trust them? Their leader is Frederic Bousson. I fought with him in Vietnam. I trust him with my life. 
Yeah, why not just set Busan's team in? I trust Busan, but I trust you more. <laughs> okay. Uh, we haven't been double crossed yet, but we're definitely like waiting for it to happen. Yeah. Once you have an ID, we'll send in the team to extract you both. And on the off chance he's not there, secure all intel at the site and exfiltrate with Martin. <clears throat> Is Grishin going to be alone? It's not possible to predict what sort of resistance you'll need. So we're taking all necessary precautions. One major concern is that Grishin seems to be on Chaos Global's payroll. But we don't know what for. The mercenaries from California. Makes sense. Not an uncommon carrier path for a man with his training and experience. And it explains why Vanjie got them the security contract for Cerulean. Precisely my line of thinking. Problem being, he may have his own security detail from KS Global. We won't know until he disembarks in Paris. I feel a lot of these plot points and world building and lore is just going over our heads. Yeah, there's so many, like, acronyms. Sneaking around with a gun and a like, there's so many alphabet organizations to keep track of. It's like, no. cannot risk the gendarmes showing up with their sirens blaring and scaring Grishin away. If you dress down, you'll have nothing to fear as long as you're outside the mansion. But of course, the lack of protection could be a hey, Lance. resistance inside. This is a big one, then. Better get ready. Your flight leaves tomorrow. We'll re-establish contact once you're on site. As always, good luck to you all. Oh wait, there was one more question I could have asked. <laughs> I guess she defaulted to that one. <laughs> also, I, I took a look at what these devs have also done, and it seems aside from this game, they've just done a bunch of old medieval, uh, like, war games. So this is kind of a departure for them, huh? It seems like it. Like, they did some from the dates, and it was like some old medieval style game, then this, then another medieval style game. Okay then! <laughs> yeah, no, I agree. I, I, I think this game is uh, really charming. I did not have to convince Bear very much to try this game. I, I just like suggested it to him, it's like, look, you play as an Eastern European woman and you're not the bad guy. And he was like, yes, I'm in. <laughs> I'm in position. Streets clear. No sign of trouble. Hey. Case, the cops are keeping out civilians. They bought the gas thing. And the fireworks will cover up any gunfire. Oh god, this is a large map. Okay. Okay. The team is set up across the street. They answer to Scepter. The extraction team is holding position at a sewer entrance. Okay. Their code name is Sabo. I'll do the rounds. Cool. Oh. And happy new year to you too. <coughs> oh, it's new year. Great. Year's Eve. Great. Okay. So, um, I'm on the street. Yeah, if, if there's there's nothing on these streets, so you're okay. Okay, I think I was told, like, because I'm dressing casually, that I should be okay outside. Yeah, there is an objective, like, straight ahead. There. They're checking in with the surveillance team. Yeah. Get a room, you two. Oh, whoa, wow, way to slide into their DMs. How long have you two been waiting out here? Our shift started seven hours ago. Great way to spend New Year's Eve. And uh, are they just going to stare at each other? What? Okay. This is an important operation. Thank you for coming despite the date. Oh, don't mind, Felicia. He feels obligated to confirm every negative stereotype about Parisians at every opportunity he gets. So how does the situation look? It's been very quiet in there. We haven't picked up anybody in or out for two days. Do you think the target is not in there? I can't say for sure. There is only one way to find out. All right, leave it to me. Keep an eye out for trouble. Of course. And make it double. Protect the world from devastation. Yeah, if you head down those stairs, the, uh... Oh. The extraction team... Are there. Ah, okay. I'll talk to them. You're supposed to check in with those. Just ask them how they're doing. Mm -hmm. 
Let me just slides in. Don't give me that French shit. And it's whisper. Don't give me that French shit. And you are some bow. Precisement. We are all set up here. According to the how you say uh, municipal schematics, this door leads into the basement of dimension. Could I take this path? It is According to the how you say you schematic. This, this guy is just Poirot! <laughs> As soon as you have positive ID. Like, I watched my first episode of Waro on Sunday. It was really bad, and I don't know why my girlfriend loves it so much. Oh, I love Waro. <laughs> Infiltrate the mansion and find the safe house. Like, it was really bad, but in, like, a really... endearing kind of way. Okay, there is a camera on the front door, but I can fix that. There okay. you go. So this is the mansion? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Also, there's an idea for a bass owner theme, just borrow. I mean, we have noir detectives, we don't have classy detectives though. Oh, Black Arrow is great. Well, it depends on the season. Oh uh, yeah, the first season is really bad. Ah, thank you for moving that camera as well. Um, uh, there is a locked door there, but you will have to get into it yourself. Uh, in this direction, where I'm going? Uh, no, to your left. To my left. Uh, the one straight ahead? Yes. Okay, so I have to force it. Got the achievement, Keymaster. Camera in here, but I can fix it. Okay, let me know when it's safe to move. Okay, I see it. Yeah, found. you're perfectly safe. How's it look? There's nobody here. It's all empty. Is that good? No, probably. Hey, your objective is in the basement. Okay, this feels like a trap. Absolutely. Um, is are there people around? No. I think we may have missed our friend grabbing some intel. Man, remember mini disc. <laughs> Man, remember the libraries? This is like Resident Evil all over again. Uh, so, so, uh, do you know where the basement would be? Yes, but it looks like the only way to get into it is from the sewer? Uh, that's the exit that the extraction tent is on, so we have to find a different way. Anything behind this door I should know of? Uh, can't, I can't see anything on this floor at all. Oh, okay, that's good. I can't see... There's cameras, but there's no people. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait! Oh! There's a person over there. And that. Okay. They're going in my direction. Okay, they turned around. It's the police, it's the popo. Uh, can you lower oh, that no. camera again and I will go, um... See if I can go to the basement over there. Uh, this camera up here? Yeah. That one. Okay. Yeah, you got it. Now let me check this area before I go and deal with the popo. I think I still have a mini disc player, like my ex boyfriend gave me in two thousand three. You can tell it was a while ago because I had a boyfriend. Yeah, I was about to say. Okay, my progress was saved, so I assume this is the correct direction. There's another camera, I see you lowered it, thank you. Yep, I got it. Uh, anything through this door I should know of? Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything important in that locked room. Okay. But this room will give you access to another... Gives you access to the master bedroom. Okay. 
There's a transformer I could blow up if I wanted to, I guess. Please don't. <laughs> Please don't let me know at least for so I'm prepared mentally. Oh, but it's been so fun every time. It's never gone badly. <laughs> yeah, as far as I can see on the map, there's no people around. But... Oh, there's lore here. I'm just gonna do some hacking while, uh... Yeah, it's see Crack Crackazoid is this guy's password. Yeah, it seems like um, the way I, the place I need to be is straight below me, so I need to go around and find a way. Up oh, there's a camera. Oh, uh, that hasn't detected me. Everything's fine. So I think I need to just go straight down. So somebody in their email got a limer is subscribed to Limerick a day. Okay. A flea and a fly and a flu were in prison, so what could they do? Said the fly, let us flee, let us fly, said the flea, so they flew through a floor in the flute. Uh, I see a copper, if you can tag him on this floor. Yes, he is. I'm trying not to tag the electrical transformer. Yeah. There's also a camera, but I will. Yeah, I see the camera. Okay, I need to see how much this guy patrols. Like, does he do a full circle or no? Oh, camera, 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 fuck! I need to take out this camera. Oh! So I can move to the other okay. side, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, it's because this guy's doing a full loop. Uh, when I leave I'll let you know, so we can move to the other camera. Okay, I'm just hacking an email right now, just for something to do. Okay, so this guy has passed, I'm gonna try and go on the other side. So you can lower the camera. Hey! Oh, I guess this room is not even a thing. Um, it does have a dead drop spot in it so that I can give you like health or ammo or something like that if you need it. Okay. Um, do you know hmm, you can't you don't actually have a floor plan, right? Yeah, I have a floor plan. Oh, okay. Um do you know in which direction I need to go to get to the basement? Let's see. Well, the basement is there. Okay, there is a way in through the sewers. Yeah, but we can't do that one. That's, I think, our exit once we get extraction. That's the only way I can see. Mm, okay, then there must be some hidden path from here. Because it did save our progress. So, I'm gonna open this now. There's a there and there. Is there. Wait, is there even anything on the other side? Oh no, there isn't. Okay. Yeah, the only way in is through the sewers. Hmm. Interesting. So I think I maybe need to go down? Yes. Okay. Okay, I see a set of stairs. Probably gonna need to go down through the room. Yeah, just watch out for those dudes. Yeah, I need to see what the patrol route of that number two is. He just goes back and forth. Yeah, 
Yeah, you need to be heading out of the exit. And back into the sewers, I think. Uh, there's a camera over there. Can you deal with it? Yeah. Thanks. Are this coming back? No, he seems to be going through a hallway. Oh no, wait, there's a okay, I guess. If this is the thing about stealth games, your instinct is to be quiet because you're trying to be stealthy. <laughs> Was yelling at me for that when she was streaming Hitman, and now I've got to eat my words. Okay, apparently there is a way into the basement. Hey. Okay. Um. Well, somewhere, according to a note I just found. I'm just gonna wait for this guy uh, to come past here, and I guess I'm gonna try and go behind him. That guy's staring straight at me. Uh, now he's not. No, number oh, one. Wait. Number one, I meant. There we go. Oh, um, shit. I got you. I was paying attention that time. Oh, shit, 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 shit. shit. Oh shit. Ah, uh, I'm stuck. Damn it. Oh no! Hmm. So it looks like that was progress. I only got spotted, that's the problem. So I need to get past those guys somehow. Let's try and switch to non-lethal ammo. Don't unconscious bodies draw more attention than dead ones? Ah, uh, I do not know. I think I remember reading that in a, like one of the tooltips and being incredibly confused because surely it should be the other way around. I guess because they're breathing? Maybe? Okay. okay, so go back here. So let me just. Oh shit, let me do this. Oh, that's dropping it. What was the ammo switch thing again? I need to open controls. Next magazine, previous magazine must wheel up. No? Oh, reload select magazine. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that room's just a dead drop. Okay. As far as I'm aware, there's no cameras in here, so... Yeah, I'm just trying... no dudes. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just getting files here. Oh, there was only the one file. One here... Whoop, camera. I got it. I think I can just go through here and avoid it. Oh. Thank you. Ok, 
Okay, there are some stairs in that room down below, but I'm not sure if they go down or up. So I'm trying in to fact, they must go down because there aren't any stairs above these ones. Because this is the highest floor. I got that camera. No, I'm just very confused because now I think I'm okay. There is this the part I was looking for. Yeah, there's a copper there. Hold on, let me grab the camera. I wonder if I can scout for dudes. No, I can't scout for dudes. Yeah, there were there were two down there. Yeah, I guess the other camera can't see them. Perfect. Okay, there is a man right there. Mm-hmm. There's another man patrolling. Hey, he just opened the door. That one. There we go. I think I might be able to take down the take down number two as soon as he decides to appear, and then that should leave number one exposed enough. Except two has a bit of a sporadic patrol pattern; he doesn't always go inside. Yeah. Um. You could throw a pager to pull them away. Oh, is he going upstairs? Oh. Going here now. Okay, I can take him down. Oh, camera. I got it. Thanks. Let me grab the intel. Didn't see the. Which. Oh okay. god, you're on the wrong camera. Okay. No, it's fine. Uh, uh, lower that camera, please. Okay, while he's distracted, just run, maybe? Okay, I'll do that. That works too. Okay. I did not mean for that to happen, but uh, hey, it all works. Up camera. It all worked out in the end. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Thank you. Okay, VHS tape. Okay, anything in the room? God, I Red Intel VHS tape is Intel vape. <laughs> like, what are they like getting into vape pens now? Okay, um, there's no dudes in this room, but there is a dude over there. There's a dude over. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if there's any more. There's a pizza here. Pizza Delicious. box. Bunch of trash here as well. Okay, but can you eat the pizza? Also, uh what kind is it? Ah, uh, it doesn't say. It's generic well, pizza. Wait, is that? That's just terrible. Is that Coca Cola? That's a cola, but without a bootleg logo. It's a very Coca Cola logo. Okay. Hey, I got the camera. Okay. I see a locked door down by where number two is. Okay, that might be where that I need to go. That might be a way down. Yeah. Or it might be a way up. Let's. Will I be spotted by anything? Okay, actually, I see one is in the hallway. No, one is on the other side. 
Oop, there's two. The only thing I can think is throw a throw a pager into the hallway. I think I could get him because he's turning around right now. Just get that camera. Yep. Kinda had a bit of clipping down there, but I think it's all good. Oh wait, let me just have uh -oh. it. Yeah, yeah, just need to wait for number one to pass. Yep, stairs down. Okay. Or we're saved. So I think we're on the right track. Okay, I see you lower your camera. That that looks like a big fat trap, by the way. Yeah, it really does. Just be careful, I guess. Yeah, if you see anything, let me know. Oh, that's fireworks. I was like, what's that sound? <laughs> I think I need to go through that door in the center. Yes, you do. I should be worried about. Um, there's a camera in the corner, but I've got it. Okay. I just keep heading up from here. You'll get to a locked door. Is there anything in the room? Mm, a dead drop spot. Let me see if there's lore in it. No, there is no delicious lore. Oh, camera, camera! Thank you. Okay, I see the locked door. Got some uh, sweet intel here. If Katya would kindly pick it up. Uh, do you have a code for this? Uh, where is it? Uh, aha, there it is. Alright, it's been a while since I actually had to do any hacking in this. Uh... Yeah, and then much the hack in a old ancient mansion. Sorry, Jewish mansion. Four, three, one, five. Four, three, one, five? Correct. Yes, Lens, I have indeed found the basement. I think this is Grisha's also, power surges suck. There's nobody here. Shit, I don't like this. I'll take a look around. Ah, we, we totally. So, from what I read up, uh, when I was trying to figure out how much we have to the end of this game, if we had a footprint of below 50, uh, we would have found him here, and I think that would have ended the game. Okay. But we don't, so he ran away because he knew somebody was chasing him. He left his computer here. Better than nothing. Plug me in and let's see what's on it. Hey. Okay. I'm uploading Grisham's hard drive to you. Whisper had no contact. Whoop. <laughs> Castle? Stand by, Condor. What the hell? Lost contact to the support teams. Are you seeing anything suspicious? Oh, are we getting double crossed? This is Condor. Do you copy? Oh, we got double crossed. This is Condor. Do you read we got so double crossed. Who called it? We got triple cross. Abort! Abort! Get the hell out of there! What's going on? Castle? We're under attack. Repeat, Castle is under attack. Do not oh, we called face. it. Fucking you. This is so unexpected. 
Okay, leave. I need a door code. A uh, door code. Uh, let me. Nine, one, four, five. Oh, God. Oh, shit. I think these are some cleaner dudes. Oh, they have armor. Shit. Yeah, because we're not good at the game, the game is a little bit longer. Okay, yeah. keep running, keep running. Trying, there's gas here. Shit. <laughs> I got gunned down. Um, yeah, they had armor, that kind of screwed me over. <laughs> oh. Because I had, I had, I didn't have armor piercing ammo, I had knockout ammo because I didn't expect to get double crossed. God damn it. We uh, did though, that's the thing. We totally expected to get double crossed. We just didn't prepare for it this specific mission we were in character to get double we we, we knew uh we would get double cross but in character we didn't know we would get double cross so we played in character oh this is one of those role-playing let's plays i see yeah yeah where the gm was like like oh wait you want armor piercing ammo but you have no reason to have armor piercing ammo why would you pick it like your character would never have armor piercing ammo <laughs> it's like i i just want it okay <laughs> i hate those dms by the way <sighs> Okay, I, I do have regular ammo. Uh, okay. If, if the game. I just gotta, yeah, I gotta get you through the door. 9135? No. Accidentally hacked somebody. Security door. 9145. Close. Close. Um, hold on, I'm just gonna hack this computer real quick. So I may have murdered a few people, but I give no fucks. Yeah, just keep going. Go. I need a camera downed. Yep. Thank you. Oh shit. Switched the wrong ammo. I pressed R to reload by forgot I had different magazines. Hey, you should be alright now. Okay, I'm holstering my shirts in case the police come over. Do we even- we don't even have the extraction team. I need to just get to the van. Ah, that's where the van is, okay. Yeah, the van is where you are. Yeah. You should be... You should be safe. Oh, who the fuck is this guy? What the fuck? There's a dead soldier here. Yeah, let's just get the fuck out. Are you alright? I can't hear you talking. <laughs> I'm, because I'm in the van. We gotta try for the metro. It's our only chance. You want to blow it up? Okay. okay. Apparently, we need explosives now. Is where even are the explosives? I'm trying to find. Oh, back on the upper floor. Like the very upper floor. Camera, camera, camera. Oh, one sec, I... Thanks. Okay. Oh god, there's somebody spying me. Shit. Yep, under a camera. Oh, there's a dude inside? Fuck my life. I know, right? Uh, is it on the ground floor or upstairs? Uh, upstairs. Okay. Okay, 
Okay, um... Uh, down this corridor. Shit, dude's coming my way. Yeah, actually, it might be easier to get through that way. Then go around. Yeah, head out of that door and then straight in front of you. Camera. Yeah, and do it. and do it. I got. It. It's fine. Okay, I see the explosives. Okay, I got the explosives. Okay, and the metro station is on the... ...ground floor. Okay. Uh, can you get the camera, please? Yes. I don't know why it's still yellow, I have control of it. Okay, now watch out when you head downstairs. There was a dude hanging out directly in front of the steps, but he appears to have gone now, so you should be fine. Yeah, it seems number two. I have number one and number two. Uh, so do I need to- Okay, I see where he is. Okay, you're, you're fine to leave this room. Camera. Yeah, we're going towards the bad ending. We did it! Playstyles achieved anonymous. We have a lawful footprints. Yeah, 700. Yeah. That this was our worst mission aside from that one mission where we fucked up Ellie. Marsh, I have like in the like I've had a few thousand of them sometimes uh, on YouTube. No idea. How have you been? Well, I've been running for my life. You're safe here. This place is secure. We've made sure of it. What about the others? Is everyone not liking the shaved head here, Katya? No one could have made it out of there alive. So it's all over then. We're all that's left. It's not over. I will not let it end like this. You have a plan? We do. Let's go over everything when we're ready to leave. Yeah. So if we were more stealthy, we probably would have had the entire base still available. Yeah, Katya has a wonderful habit of vibrating when she's talking. Yeah. Ah, these are the old, the old docks. Like, I wish, like, I think if we had enough practice, we could probably, like, stealth this game, but it would be so boring to watch on a stream because it would be pause, reload, pause, reload, pause, reload all the time. Yeah. Like, it's kind of when I play Hitman, I, I never reload a checkpoint. Hey, somebody who knows computers, tell me what this is. Yeah, I think because our old save house uh, got sabotaged, 
Um, is this a Bitcoin? Or it might be a Bitcoin. Yeah, the, there's a. If you come over here, there's a thing you can read. Oh, the long string. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that. Also, there's some vodka. Never enough vodka. Um, but yeah, for those not sure what's happening, basically, uh, because we left enough of a footprint on the previous missions, aka, you know, bodies got detected, things like that, the target we were gonna get, um, knew, uh, we were after them, uh, so they set up an ambush and basically screwed us over on this mission. Can we, like, talk to him? Oh, we can. I know it's none of my business. Okay. We couldn't be bothered to make another model of the dude, but like all we had to do for Katya was take off like the mesh that we used for her hair. Uh, all right, we're on our own now. But if you want to go after Grishin, we're with you. If we're going to do this, we need to get back some of the things we lost when they took down Kingbridge. We need uh, satellite access, so I'll have eyes again, and we need a KBE database so we can figure out where Grishin is now. Our best bet is to return to uh, Cyprus and search the HQ. Told you. Told you that the RH HQ was going to be a level. Um, Grishin knows Why does we're. It looked like there was an explosion in front of this door. I don't know. Grishin knows we're oh, still. Grishin knows we're still alive, so his people must have. Uh, the place under surveillance. We just gotta be the response time. Fast in, fast out, no sweat, right? Obviously, there's no public space here. Okay. Also, there's a letter for you in the bedroom. Oh, yeah, I read that. Uh, well, I skimmed over that. Well. Oh, yeah, here's, here's a Bitcoin for you, Fre uh, Fred. Ah. So, should I take the depleted uranium bullets now? No! <laughs> don't do war crimes! But now it's personal. That's like the number one rule of life. Don't do war crimes. It's a very easy rule to follow. Page reader. Flashback. Remote modem. I guess nerve gas is also a war crime. Oh no, Marsh is advocating for war crimes. Iphone is only advocating for regular crimes. Look. It's like angel and the devil on your shoulder. Look, if we resort to war crimes, then how are we any better than the enemy? It's true. Although I don't know who our enemy is at this point, because the plot for this game is completely fucking incomprehensible. So my, what I understand from everything so far, um, this flashbang not good, yes. What I understand from everything so far is, this dude has been killing off agents in some weird pattern, and we were like, oh, somebody's killing off agents from different agencies, we should probably look into that. Um, and we were looking into that, but also we are an illegal operation and not actually internationally sa sanctioned or sanctioned by any nation. Oh, wait, are we the war crimes? Technically, we are committing war crimes, just by existing. Um, but we were trying to hunt this guy down, and we didn't hunt him down, and he knew about us, so he screwed us over, so now we're... Because he screwed us over while we were trying to hunt him down, now we want revenge. Wait, the, the Czech guy that was in the basement, <coughs> is right. he the... He is also the war crimes. Yeah, but he's dead. Martin, we need to yeah, but that doesn't mean he didn't commit war crimes. I believe Josiah had some Black Ops access codes. It's possible like, he had all of those weapons, and he, he knows how to use them. He, Presumably, he's used them himself. He bought them from the legal markets. We find the codes, and if they still work, we can secure an overhead platform. Step two, the Kingbridge network. We'll need to download the database from the analysis office so we can restore contact with Kingbridge's network of support assets for one last mission. Which brings us to step three. Find and capture Christopher Grishin. Why? Why go after Grishin? The CIA and FSB want nothing to do with us anymore. That much is clear. 
Why don't we just cut and run? If we run now, we'll be running forever. We need to get Grishin so we can end it now, once and for all. You'll trade him in? That's right. We hand Grishin over to CIA. At least they'll see we're still cooperative. If we're lucky, they'll debrief us and allow us to re-enter service. It may work. But where does that leave you? I don't think they people? will no allow any of those things. My hope like, is to make you've been doing crimes. With the CIA and then find a better way to make a living. There's a lot of wishful thinking in this plan. It's all we've got. If you have a better idea, now is the time to speak up. I guess we better get ready then. Good luck to all of us. And Godspeed. Mash cut to a loading screen. <laughs> I mean, we need a lot to survive this loading screen. I keep getting not responding errors uh, while the game is loading. Yeah, I get those too. I think it's just because the game is coded on pixie dust and wishes. But yeah, from what, I... from what I've read, guys, if we leave like a 50 put footprint for the entire fucking game, which is basically ghosting, not taking down anybody, anything, then you get like a good ending. Okay. So is this our old office? I think it is. Uh, yes. You can tell by all the blood. Okay, cool. That's an empty room. Yeah, maybe, maybe there is a lore. Like this one. Operation dates. Oh, double shift during operations. Wow, I, I bet they don't even pay overtime. Sur search uh, Josiah's office for a satellite codes, install a root kit on Sarah's computer. Okay, seems easy enough. <laughs> like, I'm so glad this is actually a level. Uh, because we both yeah, called, we called it. it being a level. <laughs> like, we called it the first time we were here. Okay, anything? Anyone? Uh, no, I don't see anyone. There's some cameras, but I'll take care of those as we need to. Okay, I'll go... Let's go to Josiah's office because that's up top. We can go work our way upwards, up top, up from the top downwards. What is this level again? Uh, so because uh, the bad guy figured out who was chasing after him, um... Uh, he basically found our base, uh, sent like an army there, and they killed everybody. So now we're back here, trying to get access to the network from our organization, uh, so we can make use of the assets for one final missions. Oh, I can add a modem. Do you need a modem for this? Please tell me you need a. Please tell me you need a modem. I have never used a modem for anything. No, I don't need a modem. What the fuck is it even for? I don't know. Do, do you like bypass stuff if I had a modem? I have no idea. Oh man, I found your psych evaluation. As per our agreement, my immediate priority was to determine if your employee shows any time signs of post-traumatic stress. Clear symptoms have indeed shown themselves during our sessions, which is quite normal given Miss Kozlova's past as she has explained it to me. Though the patient is obviously a person of strong emotional fortitude, I advise regular counselling in the future. She may be successfully repressing her symptoms for now, but they will only get worse if left unaddressed. The records that you sent me showed that Miss Kozlova had never been examined for antisocial personality disorder. I went through the basic test with her and found Miss Kozlova to be quite neurotypical. This is good for the patient, of course, but may make her less suitable for certain types of work. One important concern is her self-reported drinking habits. It is apparent that Miss Kozlova's alcohol consumption is con increasing significantly <laughs> during her time with your company, and though she is glib about it, it's obviously causing her some problems, not a not least in her social life. I have promised Miss Kozlova not to go into more detail on my reports to you, so I would strongly recommend that you work with your employee to find a better, healthier outlet for her personal issues. 
Finally, I leave you with a simple and practical piece of advice. Ms. Kozlova has several times expressed irritation with your open office environment that I understand contains many transparent walls. If your situation allows, it may be advisable to move her to a quieter and more isolated office to ensure that her mental health remains optimal. I mean, same. I really don't like open offices. <laughs> um, McMansion Hell actually did an article about that recently. Like, open plan offices are, like, actively bad. Yeah, I hate them. Not just from a productivity perspective, but from design one. Uh, okay, uh, install work on Sarah's computer. Yeah. So yeah, did, did you know you have PTSD? I mean, I guess. The drinking problem comes as no surprise. Hmm. Yeah, I don't like open offices. I prefer closed offices, and I have only ever worked in one company that gave me closed offices, and it was really good because nobody could bother me when I went to get work done. Okay, you get to install a rootkit on the computer so that I can hack it. Yep. Oh, right, cameras. Oh, I can't actually. Okay, I have to go through uh, the big open office. But I remember open offices, you always think somebody is looking at your monitor and it's like... Whenever somebody approaches you, it's always when you're like checking chat or YouTube and it never looks like you're working and you just get annoyed. At least that's me. <laughs> hey, you should be okay in here. Yeah, I feel like people are gonna spawn after we get what we need. Yeah. And that or it's one of those really easy missions. Yep, I see it. Hold on, let me hack this. Let's see if we can find out more about your PTSD. Okay, so we are getting people. Okay, you need to download Kiwi from the servers. Reach the depot and wait for Marshy to download the data. Okay, the depot is, I'm guessing, the th uh, thing where our check friend was. Do you need me to hey, hold on, I gotta download a thing. We don't have time for that. Listen, this is the last time we'll be here. I'm grabbing a few things from my desk. Do you want anything from your office? Alright, there's a couple of CDs on my desk labeled Utils and Ghostfeed. Grab those on your way through. That's all I need. Ghostfeed? Just something I've been working on. Okay. Okay, I think I got things from your desk. I got your CDs. <laughs> Thanks. Oh man, I could hack your computer. Let's hack your computer. Your password, by the way, in case you forgot it, is X O O X O Tundra eighty six. What? Okay. So I'm trying to remember. Oh, you got a you got an email from your dad. Oh, dude, is my character on good terms with, uh... It, it's... My sweet Katinka. Your mother was so relieved to hear that you're alright. We tried to accept that your work leaves you with little time to spare, but it would put us both at ease if you would write a little more frequently. Even for you, two months is a long time without any word. Government men came to see us six weeks ago while we were at work. They talked to your mother and I separately, but at the same time, perhaps hoping to catch us in a lie. We told them the truth. We knew nothing. It was not the first time the government has come with questions about you, but I always hope it will be the last. Please stay safe, Papa. And then you have another Bitcoin from Daniel Mansour. Uh, I need uh, your help. There's mercenaries about. Yes, there are. They're in the big, Boop. They're in the big room. Boop. There are only two of them? Oh, there's three. Fuck. Is there more than three? Oh, it looks like there's more than three. 
Okay, where are they going? Where are they going upstairs? No. One is going upstairs. One is going in the back. One is here. This place really got huh? Hello, I'm hit, I'm hit. I like that when he saw you, he was just like, hello. What happened here? Are you okay? No, you killed him. Throw, throw the fucking grenade. Okay, I need to check what the button is for the fucking grenade. I'm getting annoyed with the controls in this game. I guess it's G. That was one of the things that I saw in the negative reviews, is that the controls can be clunky. Yeah, it's like, and if you're stuck at the wall, you can't do anything. Oh, I need to go back. Okay. At least it checkpointed us in a decent place. Yeah, I just need to go back to our offices. I was hacked my own computer. Can you can you get can you hack the camera? Oh right, do my job. Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, let's see. Thorough use gadgets. G. Okay. Do you need me to bring you anything from your office? We don't have time for that. Listen, Give me a this hand is the here. last time we'll be here. I'm grabbing a few things from my desk. Do you want anything from your office? All right. There's a couple of CDs on my desk labeled Utils and Ghost Feed. Grab those on your way through. That's all I need. Ghost Feed? Just something I've been working on. All right, I have to download some uh, stuff. Yeah, you do that while I uh, get stuff. Hey. Downloading data. Hey. Okay, so... Oh shit, I forgot to give XP. Marsh, can you do exclamation mark at XP 50 for the previous Paris mission? I was just about to say that. Thank you, Marsh. Ah. There we go. I don't see them moving. Are they waiting for me to trigger something? There we go. Okay, there's four of them. Yeah, even mark three. Um, I'm gonna hide here and wait for one of them to pass. Okay. Uh, just make sure that camera is down. Okay, three and two are going up. Uh, number two is going upstairs. So I can... Mark, other guy. Get back here. Go. Wow, that is the slowest fucking grenade of all time. Yeah, that's what you say when you get shot. God, I got shot. Okay, is there anybody outside? Aside from the guy on the top? As far as I can tell, nope. There should be a fourth somewhere. Yeah, he's upstairs. Okay, because I killed two guys. Where I knocked out one guy and killed one guy. No, you're safe, they're upstairs. How do I open this door? What the fuck? Do you know how I get into the area? That's a really good question. 
Oh, it's it's here. What? No, no, no. Go, go back that way. Keep going. Okay. Oh, oh, that I just go through the exit. I thought I had to go from there. Oh, I love no, her. No, 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 no. Go. Okay, head downwards. Oh, downwards. Okay. No, 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 no. no. Oh, that, that, is, that is downwards. Sorry. Oh, Elf. that. Okay. There you go. Make sure those are the only two people. Yeah, there's only those two. Fuck him. Excellent. Uh, let me just check. Gym area, make sure there's nobody here. Nope. I'm very much in the kill everybody mood now that everything's gone to shit. Okay, say one guy over there. Is there anybody else? Let's see. It's so only him, and if you can move any camera, I can take him down. Oh, nope, he has a friend. There you go. Oh, wow, there's a lot of people here. Okay. Oh, what am I helping you with? Uh, that one. Yeah. Okay, I gotta get you the door code. Oh, there's still the guns here, okay. Hey, there was an entire section marsh where we basically just... Did you just blow up a thing? Yeah, now they're out of your way, go. Oh. What was the code? Uh, three seven eight. Three seven, three, seven eight. one. Do you want to leave this level? Yes. <laughs> yeah, we did that one level where we used like where we had a military squad and we just used knockout ammo, like non-lethal ammo. Uh, and that made it infinitely quicker. You know, after playing for 20 minutes and then dying and then getting checkpointed back 20 <laughs> minutes. And it was just like, felt good. I'm not getting a good ending anyway. Hold on, let me first do the thing. Thing? Yes. I'm going to get the ability to cause a distraction. There's also a camera. I need your help. Dagger is still searching upstairs, but no contact yet. Well, let's make sure how many. Okay, there's four. One. Make sure you cover the warehouse and the server area. Three. Yeah. 
one guy that looks like he's about to go up on his own. That works. Oh god, reload. Shit. That was our ammo. Hey, that man seemed absolutely confounded by, like, a door. Uh, no, I threw a flashbang. So everybody was confounded. I kind of rushed because the, you released the back camera to get the for front camera, so I rushed in. I had no choice. Um, let me okay. do it like... So just lower that camera. Condor, need something done. Um. And only keep that one down, don't touch the other one yet. Okay. Okay, I gotta take control of this other camera, like, super quick to see how many dudes there are. Okay. There you go. Maybe was a false alarm. Okay, I'll try and get number one. That's weird. Did he actually hear me? What the fuck? Okay, there he goes into the void. Okay. Uh, you can grab the other camera. Hey. Anything in this area? There's a camera. Yeah. There's several um, cameras. Trying to figure out which one's the best to. Okay, I can cause a distraction for you. Hmm. If it's a good one, sure. Uh, I need to grab this camera still. Okay, so that may not have been the best idea. Oh, I'm done. Let's not do distractions anymore, I'd say. Because, <laughs> that, because that just alerts the entire floor. Yeah, whoops is basically like the subtitle for these places. Yeah. Oh, okay, we're checkpointed very generously, but you need to remark the guys. Okay, let me find them first. I see There's one, one here. Why can I not take cover here and so dumb? Okay. Okay. Two, okay. Three. I think that's where I need to go. Oh uh, yeah, you need to go through through there. Mm, I think I need you here. Uh three five three eight. Three five three eight. Okay.
Can you get the camera? You're up, Condor. Yep. Uh, watch out, there's a dude patrolling, like... Right behind that door. Okay. Uh, there's also a med kit in that room. I think I'm fine for now. That room's safe as far as I'm aware. Okay, I see it through down there. Oh, camera, 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 it's not actually safe. <laughs> it's actually the opposite of safe. <laughs> Okay, you should be able to slip out. Yeah, I can get that guy. Um, just need him with my back with his back turned. I just want to shoot something. I just want to shoot something. So there is one guy over there. Should sure, I might have fucked this up? Camera, 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 camera. this room. Yeah, you should be fine. Famous last words. Listen. Well, technically you're not gonna die, so it's not your last words. Oh, there are... Oh, Shit, I don't have ammo. Damn it. Changing your... Changing your magazines is the most annoying fucking thing in this game, I swear to god. You know how you change you know, your ammo? You hold R and then you do the scroll wheel until you find an ammo with that- uh, until you find a clip with the uh, ammo in it. I see. Yeah, it's really annoying. <laughs> god, where is gonna checkpoint us? Okay. Okay, let me mark these dudes this time. Yeah, no, this is fine. You didn't really give me enough time to mark them, so... Oh uh, yeah, I got kind of spotted on everybody. Just kind of yeah, went in. Reveal everybody. Okay. There should only be one dude. Okay. And there's the two dudes. It sure did. Much like his face. I get it. Okay, there's this guy over there. more creepy about Katya's butt. And you get to join the corpse <laughs> pile. And you get to join the corpse pile. Ugh, the staple of every stealth game. <laughs> K 
Hey, go around the back of that wall instead of the front, because there's a camera on the front. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. See, only two guys marked, I don't know if that's everybody, though. Yes, I believe that's everybody. Okay. And make a distraction. No, no, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> I don't think he'll be fine. Dude! Okay, well, we're getting screens, I'll be right back one moment. Alright. Uh. It's only a moderate concussion, he'll be fine. Um. So, just so people are aware, to get the good ending, you need less than 50, and we got 920 in one mission. Also, Mars, can you drop uh, 50 XP in the chat? I'm gonna wait for um, Bay to come back so I can. If there's a cinematic, so we can all see it. And we have only one mission, I think we can probably power through and finish it. Okay. Okay. Ready for the final mission? Totally. I don't know how long it'll be though. Yeah, I don't know either. I think probably half an hour going by everything else we've had. Are you able to play yeah, for half an hour? Is that half an hour if you're doing it well? <laughs> we can check the blitz time. I trust everything went off without a hitch since you're both alive. <laughs> We ran into some resistance, but we handled it. KS Global? Yeah, they had the compound under observation. We expected as much. So we're ready to move on Grishin now? We'll have satellite coverage. We'll have our support. Now just stop vibrating. Best shot we've got. Do we actually know where he is? We've got all the files from KVE. That means we have the stuff we uploaded from Grishin's laptop in Paris. What if it's not in there? It's in there. <laughs> oh, there we go. Mr. Sugar. I've been working on some new passports for all three of us. Almost done. Did they teach you that during knock training in the CIA? Sure. They never taught you any forgery? I didn't get the full training course. I was never that valuable to them. Well, I'd say they shot themselves in the foot then. So, ghost feed? It's a set of scripts I've written for the surveillance. It intercepts a CCTV feed and records 10 seconds of footage. Then you can simply cut the feed whenever you want and leave it off. Only one feed at a time, but better than the usual time. Rate. Wow, that sounds useful. It's almost done. I'll have it ready for the mission. Oh, hey. Yeah, that sounds useful. Why didn't you have this for the entire game? Well, they were on the discs. <laughs> Gosh. That makes even less sense. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I guess he wasn't finished with them. So he couldn't finish them in his high-tech office in a secure facility, but he could finish them on some dude's dining table? Look, he was browsing, uh, bulletin boards, okay? So the blitz time for this is five minutes. Okay. So I think we should be able to do it. Oh wait, no. Yeah, we should be so okay. Sorry, wrong mission. It's six minutes, though. Okay. The KP database still had all the files we uploaded from Russian safe house, and through unspeakable acts of dark computer magic, I found Grishin. EH-16 uh, or Echo Hotel is an old KGB signal station in the Ural Mountains. KS Global took it over from KGB and has been using it to train their special operations group for an upcoming deployment. Guess who's in charge of that group? Daniel is going to create a big, suitably romantic distraction to draw the main for uh, force out of the compound. 
Then you can slip in and find Grishin. It's your turf. I won't tell you how. Uh, I won't tell you to dress warm. Blitz time six minutes. Okay, we can do this. Now for our final mission. Uh, what does catching the star do? Catching the star? What do you mean? On on the best owners. Oh, uh, that. Um, it adds currency, but I don't have anything you can buy with a currency. So instead, it just sets your bear on fire and that makes him dance. I thought you were like there was some star in the game. I'm like, wait, we have stars? Tyrion, this is 1996. I, I forget. Anyway, GTX 1080s don't exist. Like, this idiot hacker is like posting on BraveNet and has MSN Messenger for his friends. Maybe AOL and Messenger or ICQ. He might have ICQ. My Discord on the good thing. No, what? No. Okay. No, I, I, I just, I was listening to you. Don't worry. It's only a matter of time. Do we have Grishin? Yes. We're going to a place called Echo Hotel. KS oh man. Establishing a special. Abo Hotel. They're being trained out of a compound in oh, Southern Ural Mountains. Echo. I thought you said Abo. It's like, wait, what? B <laughs> signal station with the NATO designation EH16 or Echo Hotel. According to the Paris files, Grishin um, what computer parts make sense for the joke? The time period. Maybe like he has a Sound Blaster Pro. <laughs> God, imagine like having PC speakers and he's doing something. You just hear that screeching all the time. Listen, his computer is so good. He has a 64 megabyte hard drive. The work we did for Kingbridge was crazy, but at least we had support. We're on our own now, and you want to raid a mercenary compound in the Ural Mountains? I'm not going to give up. Not now. I'm going to get- Katya, please stop vibrating. I know you need a drink, but... <laughs> you really need to drink something. This is crazy, I know. I just can't let Brishan get away after all this. If you go, I go. Yeah. What's the plan? Martin. Can you get Nazir Patel a spot on KS Spec Ops program? That identity has too much baggage by now. But it's been a while since I last created a legend from scratch. It's about time I brush up on my skills. Good. We'll need a man on the inside. We'll give a few days to get situated, then we go. We'll need a diversion to pull the majority of the mercs away, I'm thinking. Something involving a large volume of plastic. I'll come up with some. With most of the security gone, I'll slip in and find Grishin. Extracting him will be a challenge, though. Any suggestions? I'll secure a truck. You'll have to get us across the border. All right, Danny. You Not Siberian. She's Russian. And bring your yeah. Good luck, man. Yeah. You too. Well, if she's in Siberia, it is a Siberian event winter, though. That is true. Regardless of her nationality, I could go there, and it will be a Siberian winter. Probably die. Yeah, they're kind of famous. Also, Russian winters also extremely famous. Yeah. Probably killed more soldiers in World War II than any army. I mean, it also killed a bunch of German soldiers. Like a, a bunch of French soldiers. Right. Killed a bunch of soldiers in general. Are you ready? I've been ready for an hour. Let's get this show on the road. Oh. oh, wow. This is like... This open area is taking me back to like old, early 2000s PC games. If you get what I mean. It's just like, I can't wait to see it when I watch your half of the VOD. It is just like a very open but actually constrained uh, wood woodland area. You mean it actually looks like a woodland area? Yeah. And it isn't just a set of hallways connected by more hallways? <laughs> no, it, it just reminds me of, like, of old games for that time. Like I'm just waiting for a speed buggy to go through this. Oh, there's a lot of people there. Um. <laughs> uh... I can practically see the invisible barriers, that's right, Lance. <laughs> so you you've I see you've taken over a camera. I can't not even see where the camera is. That's how far away everything is right now. Oh there's a guy up there. Do I go through the front door? Uh yeah, I guess so. 
But there seems to be some side path as well. Hold on, I found somebody's email. Okay, I'm gonna try and get this guy. Please don't turn around immediately as you stop, like a weird NPC. The Spensky sent me to clear the fallen tree on the other side of the bridge, but when the explosion hit, I obviously hauled ass back to the compound. Long story short, I think I left today's code for the rear entrance out by the fallen tree. Any chance you can pick them up for me and dispose of the evidence? Why would you... Okay. So if you can find a fallen tree, there's a... Wait, what? Who saw a thing? What? Hmm. Did he see the, the down body? I think he might have. What the fuck? How much vertical vision do they have? I don't know. Get the camera, get the camera. Thank you. Yeah, that was very weird and also very annoying that he went like... That he can like even see, like it's pitch dark. Well, that's pitch dark, but that he could see that body from up there is kind of annoying. Okay, I think I need to go around. Oh, I can maybe go up here. Yeah, I think I go up here. No? Sorry, it's an invisible battery, never mind. Silly me. Okay, head upwards. Okay. And then around? Yeah. Okay. I figured, it just looked there was like a slope that I could climb, but I guess not. Okay, progress saved. Ah, uh, camera. Okay, I have the password for the main entrance. Okay, yeah, Lolo. If you can get there. I just jumped. Oh no, there's barbed wire. It's pretty like. Wire cutters aren't, like, a thing I can use. Yeah! Hello! Okay, I see a dude. Does he see me? He might see me. That's weird. I'm in trouble! I'm dead! Okay, foliage is not that reliable. So dark, you can barely see anything. Well, I found a fallen tree. Okay. I don't know if it is the fallen tree. Well, there might be something around that area that gives you the uh, code, but I have it. Oh, you have the code. Okay, then fuck that. Oh, there's several fallen trees here. Oh wow, wow, that entrance on the other side. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, the entrance isn't there, it's... Okay, head. Continue heading forward from where you are. Okay, see where I've marked number three? Yeah. That's where the entrance is. Oh, that's where the entrance is? Okay. I'm sure somebody found the body. Uh, hold on. No, they didn't. Okay, I'll just trust you on that.
Hey, oh. I can get rid of the guy with the uh from yesterday. I'm getting soft. Okay, I can't take him down. I can kill him off. What's the code? It is seven zero three three. Seven zero three three. Nope. Okay, I guess you have to find that fallen tree then. Oh. There's like a million fallen trees here. On the other side of the bridge. On the other side of the bridge. What is even the this side of the bridge? I'm not sure. Maybe like the end of the bridge? Possibly. I'm going towards the bridge. Careful. I got. <sighs> There's not enough fucking... Wow, this fucking wall is so annoying. Well, I'm dead. So, there's this concrete wall I can lean against because it's like 5 centimeters too short. I see. Like, God, you can fucking dive. Wait, cut hole? What? Oh, uh, never mind. I got a prompt that said cut hole. On this weird part of the fence. Okay then. Hey, okay, let me. I think that door might be the one you told me to open. Yes. Yeah, it only works for that very specific part of the fence. There we go. Also wait, that guy said this was his last day before retirement, he did. There we go. <laughs> I have to kill him if his, la his last day before retirement. Okay. Nobody survives that sentence. So good. Okay. So. Reach the kill house. That's a good name. We are at full alert, pending an all clear from the response team. Until we confirm that the explosion was benign, I want perimeter checks every 15 minutes. Uh. I, I see a guy. I see a camera. Yep, there's only one of each. Yeah, I'll take down the guy, Lonely Holy. Also, I clicked out because this game is sometimes done with mouse controls. So, there you go. That should have. So, 
So if somebody saw me like lose sound for a moment, that's because when I clicked left mouse it was outside of the window. Okay, um Yeah, let's do a countdown for these. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Um okay. I just go deeper down. Yes. Um, I'm just gonna hack this computer super quick. Okay. Apparently, some of the new guys have been keeping live equipment in the unsecured lockers in the dormitory showers. I don't know if you've been made aware, but the boss is pretty strict about responsible munitions storage. Don't keep. No, these people are idiots. Um, so I'm trying to figure out where you are. I'm, I'm downstairs. I'm opening doors. There, there you are. Uh, there's a dude. There's a camera. I'm sure that camera is anywhere close to me though. Nice. Just to make sure. Oh, okay. You got that uh, one down. You got a bad love? Yeah. You wanna hide the body? Uh, yes. So I don't know how much people Do control through this. you wanna hide a body? Doesn't have to be a body. Okay, three, two, one, go. Okay, cut. Are there dudes on the other side? Uh, let me find out. Yes, there are. There are dudes here and here. Okay, that seems like it's the other room. Oh no, he seems to be going inside here. Where will he yeah, patrol? Whatever this is. S oh, it's metal grades. So. Please don't turn around, please don't turn around, please don't turn around, please don't turn around, please don't turn around. Okay, uh, let me get you the... One, one, four, four. Oh shit! Is he gonna open the door? Okay, he's not. Okay, there are lasers. Whoa. There, that's a big room. Okay, let me... There is a dude here. I think, actually, as far as dudes go, that's it. Just two? Oh, there's one there. Okay, three. I have eyes on Yeah, now you just need to get over there without catching a bullet. Where the fuck is Grishner then? Oh, there's okay. many, many dudes. Uh, so. I can. If you can get this laser. One sec, there is a door that I can hack for you. Okay. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Three, one, go. Okay. And that door next to you is 3858. Eight. Okay. Lieutenant Claybaugh, report to me in the observation room for emergency briefing. And tell your team to ready up. Wow, that's a lot of lasers. Also, there was a dude there, I think. Shit. Oh, what? How did he see me? The fuck? Okay, uh. Laser. Three, two, one, go. Okay, next laser. Go. Next laser. Go. Christopher, don't fucking move. Good move with the explosion. 
I had a feeling it might be a distraction, but you can't really afford to not investigate when something blows up. I underestimated you, Kozlova. Diversion or not, I would have never expected you to beat the I mean, we in this compound. Put a hole. Your hollow flattery. And you don't get to kill everyone I know and then act like you're my friend. I didn't kill anyone. I simply pointed the CIA at all the money that was being funneled out of their projects. And they followed that money to Cyprus. They took it from there. Oh, of course. I'm sorry. You had only the best intentions. Hmm. Sarcasm. A Swiss army knife of coping mechanisms. You were collaborating with a foreign intelligence... Are we the bad guys? ...kind of official sanction. You were renegades. Well, he's not wrong. Oh, it was all just a big misunderstanding, huh? What did you think was going to happen when they found you out? You could be selling their secrets to China, for all they knew. Really, the only sane response was to clean house immediately. This is what happened to me ten years ago. Atrastea was the previous version of Kingbridge. When the USSR collapsed, it was time for an audit in the KGB. They found Adrastea. It was Spetsnaz then. This time it was JSOC. When a spy agency finds something it doesn't understand inside itself, the only available response is to kill everyone. There are no other responses that are a lot... To do with okay. That. What yeah. happened to you is no kind of excuse for what you did to us. I owe you no apology. I was protecting myself by destroying the Kingbridge executive. You're coming with me, Grishin. We're going to hand you over to the CIA and clear up this misunderstanding. Hand me over? What good would that do you? I will not be a fugitive for the rest of my life. We're trading you for redemption. You want back inside? These are the people who sentence you to death without even knowing what you've done, just to cover their own ass. They probably didn't even know your name. You want to be part of that system again? I'm done with FSB. But Martin and Daniel can get their lives back, and I'll be fine as long as I don't have assassins hunting me. Listen, I was in your exact situation. You may not believe it, but I'm glad you escaped the raid alive. Kingbridge is no threat to me anymore. That was my only goal. You and I, we're in the same boat now. Spare me your bullshit. We're both renegades. Just like me, you're on everybody's hit list now. You can't outrun Tantalus. But you can hide, and I can help you. We can help each other. I don't want to survive at the expense of innocent lives. My dear woman, we've been able to attribute more than a dozen <laughs> deaths to you over the past six months. <laughs> and that's just the ones we know about. Listen. Do you care to tell us the real number? I would say there is a difference, but I'm not here to debate ethics with you. Do you know what Wen was doing at Cerulean? She was establishing a new source of income for us. The leaks you were investigating for Kingbridge were just a band-aid. Spectrum is the cure. You want to sell innocent people's private lives to highest bidder by the millions? You think that's better than leaking knock identities? We can control who we sell to and what we sell. But that's just a small part of it. If we have access to Spectrum, we can erase ourselves. We can finally disappear. No more running. You can do that? Because you exposed my work, Cerulean did a full security audit and found my back door. But with your help, and more importantly, your hacker friend's help, reestablishing our... So do we kill them or do we work with them? We live as renegades until they either catch us or forget about us. I'm kind of for like, fuck them. I want to work with them. We can do good with it too. We can be watchdogs. Providing NGOs and hmm. evidence of government crimes, for instance. If you help me, that decision is yours to make, as much as it is mine. Don't tell me you buy that crap. You must be Daniel Mansour. My offer extends to you and to Borsky as well. If you wanted to make the I got the door closed. <laughs> I like that he just bursts and like this is a sitcom. I kept when Richard. And yeah, I don't like bearded uh, Nathan Drake. Any damage to the CIA. Also, what's audio balancing? I don't know. That music is really powerful. I don't trust Grishin. Fuck Grishin. The intelligence community has turned its back on you. They don't deserve your loyalty. I was proud of the work I did for the CIA before Kingbridge. 
Cat, I'm just as tired of the politics and the spy games as you. That will only get worse if we make this our life. I will not spend the rest of my life on the run. We came here to set the record straight, Lucia. And you're how we do that. You're coming with us. You're making a mistake. I've got a truck waiting topside. What? Why couldn't you just run when you had the chance? <laughs> what just happened? We stabbed him in the back. <laughs> I don't understand what just happened. So Grishin was all... No, no, I understand the words that happened, but uh, like, I didn't hear any noise, and then the guy just falls over. Okay, okay. So, we told Grishin, fuck you, you're coming with us. And he was like, god, you're idiots. And then he uh, hits us, grabs our gun, points at the, the, the other dude that's working with us, and then our character's like, fuck no, and she stops him in the back and like flips him over, and mission accomplished. We did no property damage. Man, we're good. In order for print. I was gonna say, I can't continue until you do. So you came alone. You've got balls, I'll hand you that. We were expecting an ambush. Yeah, you can call up the snipers. Not just yet. Is that really Christopher Grishin you've got under there? Well, I'll be damned. Let's get you all on board, huh? I know some men back in Langley who are itching to debrief y'all. I'll pass. You sure? I know we don't get many defectors these days, but your profile... That's the deal. It's been a pleasure, guys. Are you sure about this? Surest I've ever been. What are you gonna do? I'll figure it out. Something new. Stay in touch, you hear? Of course, Martin. Take care of yourself. Keep Danny out of trouble. Those with Danya. Don't make us regret letting you go, miss. Fuck yeah, middle finger credits. It's <laughs> amazing. Yeah. Well, that was clandestine. That's the ending I wanted for Metroid Prime 2. <sighs> just Samus stepping out of a pole, giving everybody the middle finger. Like, I was only here because my ship exploded. Oh. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Lola. So how do you like this, Faye? I... I love this game. I told you from the beginning that I love this game. I, I think it's really, really charming. It's really charming and it's so different. Yeah, it, it kind of feels like, man, I wish somebody with a big budget did this. Yeah, like... Like, even the Hitman guys, like, this, like, with a Hitman would be fucking... Hitman Assassins um, would be fucking great. It's in the Hitman engine? Can you imagine? I would, like, lose my mind. I would play this all the time. Like, that would be amazing. Yeah. It's really sad it's, like, as janky as it is, but I also, like, respect how ambitious it tries to be with its modest yeah, resources. Like, it's an indie game that has... that is basically two completely different games. Depending on who's playing. Yeah, no, I'm I'm very happy we played this. This has been pretty good. Uh. Like, this is the kind of game I want to make. Like, if I could make games, this is the kind of game I would make. Super weird, super janky, and trying to marry two opposing genres. Yeah. Like, there's two games I would like to make, and that is Atelier Sophie and this. <laughs> uh, if if I had worked on something like this and shipped it, I would be pretty proud of myself. I think I'd be like, it managed to somehow get shipped. I mean, Lance, it's really jan janky. Like, like the AI is really janky. It controls really weirdly. Um, it's pretty unforgiving. You get to do a great deal at the end because it is balanced so that you can play it single player. And yeah. Single player, like if you tag a camera, it disables it. Yeah. I think like a, a few more iterations of this would probably have led to a good game, like a really good game. 
The animations were of varying quality. Oh shit, they actually Wait, thank- Wait, IO Interactive? Yeah, they actually- th it's a, they're in the special thanks section. Uh, it's- no, it's clear that the Hitman games are kind of an inspiration for this. Oh, that makes me so happy. Yeah. That, that was pretty good. I'm pretty happy with uh, uh, streaming through that and finishing it. Uh, sadly, yeah, we, a... we, we got the uh, not greatest ending, I guess. That's okay, you can go through with a friend or, like, in single player. Oh, what? Oh, it's. I think it's so we can choose any mission and replay it. Nice. While the uh, end theme is still playing. <laughs> Also incredibly loud. Yeah. Um, we're gonna stop it here. Um, thank you all for watching. Thank you, Faye, for playing this with me and suggesting we Yay! play this. If you want to watch uh, Faye do more, uh, I don't think you do hacky adventures, but if you want to see more stream adventures from Faye, uh, please follow her on uh, twitch.tv slash superhero Faye. And if uh, you don't already follow Bear, do that. Yeah. Do that thing. Yes. We're both aiming to get 500 followers by the end of the year. Yeah, and it's a pretty daunting task. Um, it is. So... But with your help, Wikipedia can continue to function. So... <laughs> let me just type... Uh, her thing. Yeah, I think I got it properly. So yeah, please give her a follow. Um, we will probably do something again next year. Like, we'll find another collab. Um, yeah, it won't. It, well, I was gonna say it won't be nearly as janky as this, but I, I like janky games. Is that, the thing. I I I like to check out janky games because they usually have very interesting ideas. Yeah, and this one definitely did. Like I sold this to you as like the best two multi like ah do 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 do. do. Sorry, my follower notification is uh, the Yi meme. Nice. Anyway, um, I sold this to you as the best two games you will play co-op. Which is true, you know, if 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 you're playing as Katya, you're playing Splinter Cell, and if you're playing as uh, Martin, you're playing NetHack, uh, NetHack, in Uplink. Yeah. Yeah. Which is... Although a significantly easier version of Uplink. Yeah, so, um, anyway, I'm gonna close this off. So, um, thank you all for watching. Tomorrow I'll be streaming uh, Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom for a Switch because it's coming out tomorrow. And we don't usually do Tuesday Hooray! streams, but I'm gonna do a Tuesday stream this week because fuck it. Um, so, yeah, uh, thank you all and I'll catch you later. Thank you everybody, have fun.